Hey, babe. What a surprise. I know, I knew you'd get home. <gasps> oh my god, it's so good to see you. It's good to see you, babe. What? Babe, you know how much I hate seeing you dressed like this. Come here. What is all this thing? What is what is this chain on your neck? Babe, this is a new fashion trend now. Hop on it. Uh-uh. A new fashion trend, hop on it. Nope. Yes. I don't like it. I do not like it. Dress my trend for goodness sake. Can you just put your trousers up oh, at least a little bit? Close your belt. Look it up. Look like a whole a grown-up man. What is all this about? Babe, I just missed you. I'm so glad it's your project that's stood away from me has brought you back to me. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah. I'm even happier. I'm glad to be home. I miss you so much, babe. <laughs> I missed you too. <gasps> I missed you so much. You see why I say we should start to be married, you know? I mean, if I were married, I would have skipped this work travel like my <laughs> other married colleagues. <laughs> What's up? I'm serious. <laughs> Even more. <laughs> Babe, are you okay? Yes, I am. I'm okay. Fine. No, you don't seem okay to me. What is the matter? <laughs> Babe, it's not the end that I told you about last time, yeah? The guys you share your apartment with. Yeah. Because you didn't use that, and to make matters worse, they now bring their loud girlfriends around to, to make noise. And it makes, it makes you so hard to concentrate. Very difficult to focus on work. Wow. I thought you already addressed that. Babe, I did, but they had a month. I, I know we shared the rent, so it's really hard to tell others what to do. You just look somehow. Wow. Then I guess it's time you, we contact the house agent to get you another place. Right? Yeah, that's another problem. Why? Why is that a problem? So we renewed the rent last week. What? Why would you renew the rent with all the inconveniences happening? Baby, making it sound like I knew this was going to get worse. I wanted to waste my money. Babe, I spoke oh. to them. I thought I was dealing with adults, so they told me yes, they will behave themselves. Is it my fault? No, I, I understand. So what are we going to do about it? I don't know, babe. I don't know. I, I don't know. Wow. If, if you ask me, I'm just, I'm just saying, you know, but like, I can stay out yours for a few weeks now. You know how this project is coming up. So that I can focus, I can be effective, you know, stay here, work. And once it opens the door for me, you know, I just get my feet, get my own place, move out. But I'm just saying, babe, I'm not like I'm forcing it to you. Uh, no, just... no, 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 it, it's fine. Okay. I mean, you're always welcome to my house, babe. Really? Yes. You mean it? Of course, you're my man. Come on, baby. I love you so much. Mm. Thank you. Thank you. I love you too. Mm. I'm sorry about all that's happening. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry. You know. Thank you so much. Okay. Mm. Love you. Love you too. Did you cook, Joe? I beg food, no, they do me. You can help yourself at the kitchen. Hmm. What's wrong? You've been moody all day, even at the office. It's enough, Fred. He doesn't talk about our plans in this relationship. It is almost like he, he avoids the topic entirely. Maybe he's not ready. How can he not be ready? We're almost two years in this relationship. So we don't have time. I'm not getting younger. At least I need to know where we're headed. That's not a good sign. The marriage conversation is important. Exactly. Because I don't even know where I stand in Fred's life. Oh. Relationships are not all about fun, sex, or hangouts. You know, he doesn't discuss his life goals or ambition with me. Uh, that's not a good thing. But you just sit up and have the conversation with him now. So we, I don't want it to seem like I'm desperate, even though I am. I know, all my younger ones are all married in your husband's house with kids. Mm, I understand that, but don't put any pressure on yourself and don't pressurize Fred. All you need to know are his plans. But what if he says he isn't ready? I know wait, you be patient. Really? Anna. It is so easy for you to say, 
be patient, be ready, because David don't give you a ring. Hey, be patient now, babe, be patient. You see, when I grow gray hair, you know that I'm getting old. Please, I need to get married. <sighs> Relax, everything will fall in place, okay? When? It will now. I beg, at it, at it. Let's go out. Now, what they do me now? I beg, help yourself. Go to the kitchen and grab something like this. Come on, help me. Sweet. Okay. Can I take that help her? Mm. Hey, babes, how far now? How are you doing? I'm good. Mm, you look nice. Thank you. You went shopping? Yes, I just changed my wardrobe now, you know. I need to see this one now. This one. Come on, take it like a two, right? But babe, you went shopping last week. Do you not shop every week? Babe, big class because of this next week. You know me now. I can't repeat feet. I've changed my feet and I get new one. I can't even repeat my feet on Instagram. <laughs> Let alone big class concert. Come on, you check them out now. Uh, okay, you said. okay. You know, I'm beginning to get confused about what your priorities are. Because all you do is go to concerts or go to the nightclubs or post pictures for the gram. Are they the only priorities in your life? I don't understand. Gina, are you trying to interrogate me right now? You know, I mean, you're just about to spend my own money. Not exactly, but you know, it is becoming sickening. Because all you do is shop and go to the nightclubs. You don't discuss anything about goals or investment or business plan with me. It was for my mood. Fred, you, you said you wanted to stay in my house because you want to concentrate with work. But I have never seen you working. Hmm. Really? Is that correct? Maybe I'll leave back to my apartment because staying with you right now is bringing disrespect. And you're going to start like this irritating me. I'm leaving. You know what? You always avoid this topic. You know, we're not done talking, Fred. Come back here. We are not done talking. I said, come back, Fred. So just be patient. Toby, I don't have time for uncertainties. Mm. How can I be waiting for someone who is not planning for future with me? Mm. So what do you want to do now? Break up with him? No, but you know, there is... I don't understand Fred even. Mm. He has this attitude I'm still trying to understand. He exhibits a lot of boyish behavior. You know, always sagging his trousers, acting immature, going for parties at this age and time. He, some men love fashion, you know, they like to live their life to the fullest. If he can afford it, why not? Eh? Wait, are you defending him? Haban, I'm only giving him the benefit of doubt, you know? You know I know you, you want to settle down, I know age is not on your side. I just want you to take things easy. That's the point, age is not on my side. So I can't take it to someone who is talking about getting married or settling down with me. He's not saying nothing. But do you want him to tell you lies? No, but I will talk to him. I need to hear something. Let him just say something. If he's not ready, then we move. Okay. All right. You see, that's not a bad plan. But I just don't want you sounding desperate. You know, that's a very red flag to most men. But I'm desperate? Uh-uh. Not like that. Not to him, at least. I mean, I don't tire. I mean, which guy can be this? You're dating someone. He's not saying nothing. He's acting like a boy. I beg, I'm leaving. Are you leaving now? Oh, me. I, I have a lot of work. Oh. Ah, I will still be here for like at least another hour. I beg, I don't tire. I'm going. See you later. Bye bye. embarrassment is that? 
You promised me you would never do that to me again, right? If I was bored. You were bored, and the best way to carry your bond up is by playing football with kids in the instant. Kids? They are not kids. Those are not kids? Yes. Freddie, you're older than those kids, at least with 10 years of age. Those kids are dressed with a smile in this instant. This will bring disrespect to me. Babe, the last time I checked, there is nothing wrong with playing football. There is nothing wrong with playing football. If you're playing football with your age, miss, Fred, all I'm asking for you to do is act your age. Play matured. It's not even Saturday yet. Do something with your time. Babe, I am tired of your too many do's and don'ts. It's frustrating for me. Fred, this is not fair to me. Because all, all I'm pleading is for you to act like a grown up man. If you don't know what to do, just do something. Read your book. Research, work, just do something. There are thousands of one things for you to do. Not playing football with some boys. Take it, take your call. Take it! No! Ah. God. <gasps> Jesus Christ. Fred! 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 Hey. Hey, babe. Hey, babe. Um, I want us to talk. Sure. I feel it's a good time to talk. All right. So I've been thinking about us lately. I just feel I should ask you, what are your plans for us? You know, um, your plans for a beautiful relationship. What do you mean? <laughs> I mean, we're going to be like two years by February. I mean, our relationship. And for once, you've never said anything like, Marriage or settling down, you know, like people who are dating. I know, like, for a man at some point in life, they want to talk about kids, you know, how many kids they want to have, and so on, you know. Hey, why are we speaking about marriage? I mean, we have our whole life ahead of us, we have so much time, so why are we rushing? No, we don't have time. We don't. Babe, I just clocked 33, right? Mm -hmm. At least I should have a cost plan of my life at this point. And you were 35 years. <laughs> you should be thinking about settling down, you know, for a young man. Babe, please don't get me wrong. But the thing is this. I I'm not ready for marriage. Please don't get me wrong. Let, let me explain. Babe, I love you. And I hope that you understand that I love you, and I hope you know that I love you. The thing is, I'm not just ready yet, babe. I'm not ready for marriage. <sighs> Why? If I still want to enjoy this life now, I mean, I still want flex life. If I'm being honest, marriage is a lot of responsibility and headache that I don't want right now. It's just going to. It's just exhausting and I'm not ready, babe. I'm not just ready. Okay. Okay, but um, I, I understand. But at least you should, you, should, you should have plans for yourself. Like, what is your time frame? What are you, what are you hoping on? You know, settling down? Babe. Honestly, right now, I, I don't know. I'm not ready. I just, I know I'm not just ready for it right now, but I still love you, babe. I honestly do. Believe me. I just don't know if I, I still have my life to live. I want to enjoy a bit. Babe, don't be angry, please. Please, babe. Babe, come on. I'm not just ready, babe, please. Babe, now. Babe. Don't be angry. I love you, I swear. I swear to God, I love you, I swear. I... Babe, please, now. Baby, babe.
baby. Uh, good. Good. How was your day? My day was stressful. I, I've been here all morning. Oh. My back really hurts. Yeah, you look tired. I think you should rest a little. I can't rest. I need to finish the four days of work today. The one I'm doing, maybe I'll rest. Oh, you work too much. What can I do, babe? Just take it easy, okay? I'll try. So how was your day? Tell me about your day. Well, as you can see, um, not that stressful. I'm fine. Right. Okay, I'm just gonna let you work right. and uh, I'll be upstairs and undress. Okay, baby, don't work too much. Nah. Babe, I was just thinking, maybe you should try and get a proper job, you know. Babe, I know I haven't paid you back the loans I took, but I just need time, I'll pay you back. No, this isn't about that, okay? Come on, it's nothing. It's not about the loan. I just feel you've been too ideal lately and um, you might need to get busy, you know, and get a good job. So maybe you should just send your credentials to me, your CV, so I can look up and help getting you a good job. How about that? What do you think? Okay, are you still angry with me? No, I'm not angry. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm sorry, please. It's fine, babe. I'm I'm not angry anymore. I'm not upset. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Do you like the food? Yeah, it's good. I like, I like the chicken, it's tasty. <laughs> Looks like you. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I am Tebe, we want to go shopping. No. Mm -hmm. No. Okay, that's fine, I'll just stay here working. Stay on working, right? that's all. I'll do more. Okay, but you want to send me to see the do? I will, I'll just hurry up and just. Um, okay, cool. Mm. this fool. How dare you deceive me? How dare you? 
till you're 24 years of age and you're school dropouts, right? I should have known with all those boyish babyish attitudes of yours. With all the sagging of trousers and wearing blings and going to, 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 to concerts and nightclubs. You know what? Leave my house this minute. Get up. <laughs> So don't you some as leave my house. Please, please. Leave me. Get out of my house this minute, you liar. I said get out. Get out of my house this minute. Please what? No, 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 no. Please what? Please, let's talk this through before we do something that we regret. Please, babe. I won't let you spend one minute inside my house before you lie your way back into my life. Please, we can't talk this through. Don't do this to me. Talk what through exactly? What do you want to talk about? No, no, no. Like, tell me what? Like, how you were supposed to be in school but you chose to be screwing your elder brother's age mates? Or how I'm supposed to help you get a job when you don't even have a degree? Or how immature you are to discuss marriage with me? What exactly? Please, please. I'm no, sorry. no, you leave this minute. Like, leave this minute. What, what do you want from me? What's going now on you here? you leave, you angry foul. Get out this minute. Get out! Wait. Wait. What's going on? Sit down, sit down. This boy has been toying with my life. Apparently, he's supposed to be his 200 level at the university. What? But he dropped out. Oh my god. Wait, I thought he was supposed to be a tech guy. He is not a tech guy. The most shocking part is that he is just 24 years old. 20 what? My god, no. No, you're lying. He was gonna continue lying to me until God knows when. Wasting my life. No, 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 no. See, it's okay. It's good that you found out this early. Wait, how did you even find out? Um, I was holding his phone and a message popped up from his elder brother. <laughs> like, where, where do I start from? Like, am I supposed to start dating all over again? Mm -hmm. with, with, uh, no, no, it's okay. Uh, no. He wasted two years of my life for no reason. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. You're just going to pick up the pieces. It's okay. It's okay. Mm -mm. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's good that you found out. It's good that you found out. It's okay. It's okay. Uh -uh, madam. You still haven't returned my spare keys yet. Just sure. when you're coming into my house like a thief. Oh. Mm, Nani. What's up? You didn't call me. Mm, we're inviting someone over for lunch. You're inviting someone over for lunch? Mm. To my house, without my knowledge. Oh. Okay, now you're away. So get up, let's go to the kitchen. I need your help. <laughs> I don't understand. Calm down, please. First of all, who are we inviting over? Uh, my old friend, his name is Yomi. You should remember him. You should know him. Yomi, I don't remember anybody, Yomi. Mm. So what is he coming over for lunch for? Uh, see this person I'm trying to help. You better cooperate too. See, he's single, you're single. Mm? He wants to settle down, you want to settle down too, so... Oh, this is matchmaking business. Ah. <laughs> hey, this is serious. See, get up. Let's go to the kitchen. I'll tell you more. Are you serious about this? I will tell you more as we cook. Let's go. <laughs> This one is home and harassment though. <laughs> hey, wait, let me get my food. Hey, hey, this is serious. From this person you invite, make sure he's a reasonable guy. You understand? So this is our special guest. At what point did you realize me and him would make a good match? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I beg you, don't put that one on me. My own is to create the meeting point. You know it depends on you guys' chemistry now. Hmm. Oh. So, where do you think he's ready and going to settle down? That's all you need talks about. Oh, I want to settle down, I want to settle down. So I, but I really think you like him now. He's a gentleman. So why is he still saying he's a gentleman? With all these qualities. See this one. Maybe it's the same reason you're single. Heartbreak. Mama, <laughs> <laughs> this heartbreak will reach everybody one day. Mm, but honestly, girl, if you're not comfortable, I can just call him to cancel. No, it's not that. Just that, um, you know, this is just like going for blind dates. You don't know what to expect. I don't even know if he's going to like me. <laughs> I think you should just focus on meeting him. Hmm? Okay, well, can I even see his pictures? No. <laughs> you think they worry you? Trust me. <laughs> Boy, no. I think how is David, Jerry? David, oh, he's okay. You know this marriage will have now. They're all busy. Mm. 
I know how it can be, right? My a lot of stress. I know. <sighs> You're late. Thank you. Mm -hmm. We're expecting her. Angel, what did you call his name again? He's just your me. Your me. <laughs> just your me. Oh, Angel. Oh, Angel. <laughs> Yomi, this is my best friend and colleague, Gina. Gina, this is Yomi, he's an old friend. Oh, it's a pleasure. Same. <laughs> okay, lunch has been served. We can talk about the app later. Okay. Oh, yes, please. <laughs> I will do the serving. Yeah. Sure. So we made jollof rice, not Ghanaian jollof rice. <laughs> and we have the salad and grilled turkey. Yeah. It smells nice, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Mm. It smells quite good. She put her foot in it. I see. <laughs> okay. So I know you don't eat too much. No, I actually do. <laughs> Especially for serving. <laughs> Okay. Okay. I mean, this your app is great too. But I know so many won't like it. What makes your own different, you know, interesting? Um, okay. Well, mine is the only one that comes with a chatting feature. Ah. Yeah. And different fancy fonts while chatting. Well doing the data analysis. Oh, 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 so that means when staffs are like in projects doing work together, they can share data via the app. Exactly. Ah, oh, <laughs> that's nice. Yeah. Are you okay? Um, yeah. Uh, your friend. Yeah. I noticed she hasn't stepped in since she went out to check something in her car. I hope we are not inconveniencing her. <laughs> Gina, no, she's fine. She's okay. Mm, just relax. Okay. Um, can I ask you a question? Sure. Um, is she single? <laughs> you know me? <laughs> so you have eyes for my friend. Of course. Uh -huh. You know how pretty she is. I've been staring at her since. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm happy to announce that she's single. <laughs> wow, 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 wow. You know, look, I would love to have the room with her. Let's oh, get oh, to know her more. Oh, oh, no problem, no problem. Okay, so here she comes. You get your chance now. Okay. Um, excuse me. Can I please get water? Oh, sure. One minute. All right. Let me just get you water. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, thank so you. already put in the saucer. No, it's fine this way. Um, okay. Sorry, excuse me. Do you do you mind sitting with me for a bit? Oh. I could do with the company. Oh, okay, where is Toby? <sighs> okay, so what's up? <gasps> ah, I'm good. So you you stay here alone? Oh yes, I do. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Well, I kind of stay alone too, but. Okay. Um, I always escape to my mom's place sometimes, <laughs> yeah. Um, so, how do you manage your boredom? Oh, well, um, Toby often comes around, you know, and when I'm bored, I just do Netflix and chill. Oh, Those nice. series help me to kill time. Yeah. Oh, you love series? 
I do. <laughs> yeah, I love series as well. Oh. <laughs> so, are you seeing the current trending one? Alchemy of, of Souls. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, I love that series a lot. It's so thrilling and suspenseful. Yeah. For me, it's the romance that got me. Yeah. You know, I got hooked from the episode one. Me too. <laughs> I then the thing stole my night. <laughs> I stayed up all night watching. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, um, are you okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, um, thank you for such a fun time. Mm, you're welcome. I'll call you. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I like him. I knew it. <laughs> he is so cool. We share the same interests. Mm -hmm. We think a lot. He is my spec. Mm -hmm. I saw the way you guys were drooling all over <laughs> each other. Who's the master matchmaker again? I mean, come down. You are too proud. <laughs> come down. But he is so cool. Mm -hmm. Like, he has real life goals, you know. He told me about the app and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's a very creative and innovative guy. I and he's see. under a lot of pressure from his mom to get married. So, he definitely wants something serious. Ah. Yeah. Who is getting the ring? Let's go. You come here. Come here, mom. I beg, I beg. You come straight. <laughs> yeah. Should we have you have kissing? <laughs> They say love is true What I found is so untrue Wanna hold you in my arms And be glad to say I am yours I thought they say love is real Too bad that's not how I feel Searching far too long for someone who specially made for me. I was all alone, your love came and you found me. You saw my bleeding heart, your love came and you healed me. Now I believe in love again. Love you more. Yeah? I think you should try this one. You know, it's the kind of thing my mom likes. She does? Yes. Oh, not you know, bad. She has a very high taste in fashion. You know, she believes that um, the one thing to look out in a woman is her appearance. Oh, yeah? Yeah. She must really have a thing for fashion, you know? <laughs> yes, yes. I can't wait to meet her. <laughs> Soon, baby. Okay, you know, I, I, I believe the two of you will just click the way we clicked. <laughs> she's, a, she's a very nice woman. 
nice. Of course, I'm not surprised because you're really nice. You really are really nice. Thank you. <laughs> you know, maybe I should even pick something for her. What do you think? Yumi, you seem to be a very family oriented person. And I like that about you a lot. Family is everything. Yeah, family is everything. Okay, I'll just go try this out for today's big day. You know, um, I want to be my best that day. Yeah, this this got you. You know, but I'm also uh, wondering why Toby didn't just pick and I should be like every other too. person, right? <laughs> I don't know why. I think it's just her choice. Yeah. Okay, I'll try yeah. this out. All right, all right, love. You will love it. It's love it's. Too. Trust me, it's something my mom would like. I told you. So, um, mommy, what do I pick for mommy? Should I, should I, should I check this one out? And this would have been nice. Oh, red. Ah, she doesn't like red. Oh, yeah, dear mom. No, no, this, this is what she loves. She will love this. Yeah, taking this. Baby? Yeah, I'm right here. Okay. Nothing. I was just wondering where you've been all my life. You are so helpful. Uh, let's just say I've been hiding. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm glad you didn't stay here for so long. I bless God that you be invited me for lunch that day. <laughs> I feel so lucky. This might not be your best topic, but I've been meaning to ask, right? What happened in your previous relationship? Oh, let's not talk about it, okay? It's just that you're so pretty, and I was wondering why a pretty girl like you was single. It's, it's fine, okay? It's, it's okay. Just that whenever I talk about it, I get really angry, you know, because he was such a terrible liar. He deceived me a whole lot. I was so hurt. But um, it's fine now. I mean, you make me fine. So it's okay. Well, his loss is my gain. I'm glad he messed up. So tell me, what happened to yours? Oh. That one. And she was so bossy and controlling. You know, she wanted to wear the pants in the relationship. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like everything had to go through her. When <laughs> she's not my mom. Look, I can imagine. <laughs> it's only my mom that can control me like that. Too. I know, right? <laughs> yeah. You know, I was taught as a lady that a woman shouldn't overstep her boundaries in a relationship. And a man is always ahead and never to be disrespected. 
God. What did I do to be so lucky? Okay, you are so easy to love. Thank you. Oh, come. Right, come to bed. Happy birthday, baby! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> oh, good morning, baby. Good morning. Yes. <laughs> wow. Maybe this is expensive. Oh, well, let's just say this is a tip of the iceberg. Oh, wow. What else do you have in this beautiful brain of yours? <laughs> mm. uh, Excuse okay. me. <laughs> um, I have to take this to my mom. Okay. Hey, mom. Good morning. <laughs> oh. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Amen, Mom. Amen. Amen. Thank you for the prayers. You're the best, Mom. Oh, um, Mom, but I... Okay, okay. It's fine. You win. I'll be there in the jiffy, okay? All right, bye. Are you stepping out? Yeah. Um, my mom wants me to come celebrate with the family. Oh, no, no, babe. I, I already set up a party at yours, and this wasn't supposed to come like this. It was supposed to be a surprise. Oh, you did? Yes, I told Toby to help me. That was why I convinced you to come over at mine, so she can have time to like set up. Yeah. <laughs> okay, why don't you just invite your mom over to your house and everyone? Then we all party together. Oh, no. That would be nice. No, babe, she won't like that. You know what we'll do? Um, let's just celebrate yours later in the evening when I get back. <sighs> okay then. Um, so I should just get ready then we leave. Well, you're coming with me? Yeah. Oh no, babe. You can't come to my family house yet. My mom's not ready to meet you. Oh. Yeah. Look, babe. I've already mentioned you to her, right? But she's not invited you yet, so let's just wait till she invites you, okay? But babe, it's your birthday. You can just tell her that you're coming with your girlfriend. Oh, babe, trust me. Okay, this is not the best time. Okay, my mom won't like it. She likes to plan things. I just relax. I will introduce you to her later. You go, okay? Does that mean I'm not gonna be around on your birthday with you? Don't sound like that. All right. When I come back later in the evening, we'll, we'll be together and do the party. Okay, <laughs> come on. Okay, but you're going to come this evening, right? Yeah, sure. Definitely, I will. I'm not happy, but that's fine. What can yeah. I say? That is my baby. All right. You want to look at it? Um, no, you know I said I'll be there in the jiffy, right? That's okay. All right, baby. Let me just um, freshen up quickly. I think I'll stop at my house first then. Go oh, ahead, just wash my face or
I'm sorry. I didn't know what my mom planned for my birthday was going to be that big. I just couldn't leave. Ifemi. Don't touch me. Look, I know you were still angry. That's why I came immediately. I finished with work today. You know, there is no need explaining. I understand. You do? But you're not smiling. Baby, you're going to get wrinkled fast if you don't stop frowning like this. Everything I planned yesterday was a waste. You wasted my entire effort. I know. Baby, and I'm sorry. You haven't even tasted the cake I got for you. Baby, I'm sorry. Okay? We can still celebrate today. You know, I felt bad that you didn't come to see the thing yesterday. My mom is such a wonderful event planner. Wow. Like everything was just on point. God. I wouldn't have missed it for anything in the world. I'm happy you had a, a great time. Yeah, I did. My mom sends her regards. So, enough of me. How's work today? was just there. Oh, was it that bad? Uh, I'm here now. You brighten your day. <laughs> you miss me. Uh, you look like you did. Me alone. Oh, you missed me. So I'm here to be helpful. <laughs> what can I do for you? Mm, nothing. Just relax. I'll take care of you. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay. No, 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 babe. Wait, what are you doing? You're slicing onion. Is that, is that how you do it? Oh, come on now. That's not how my mom does it. <laughs> I don't understand. That's not how your mom does it or you just don't like it. Ah, no, no. My mom usually blends it. And that's what, that's what I'm used to. Babe, ah, wait, you don't like blended onion? I'm indifferent about it. Blended or diced, I eat it. Ah, no, 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 babe, please. Look, blend it, okay? You should blend it, I beg you. That's what I'm used to. You mean, listen, every woman has their own style of cooking. Oh, yes, I get, yeah? But trust me on this one, my mom, it's like the best chef you will ever know. Okay, it's not by wearing apron, okay? You <laughs> see, um, um. Oh, babe, um, can you uh, help me with the crayfish inside the locker? Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> you want? You, you put crayfish in your sauce? Sure, why not? Oh my god. <laughs> Are you. Are you kidding me? <laughs> That's not how my mom does it. I can put crayfish. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Listen, um, Yumi, I like crayfish again. And don't worry, you will love it. I know. Baby, trust me. If crayfish was good, my mom would actually put it in it in the first place. Oh, you know what? You know what I'll do? Um, maybe I should just show you how my mom does it, okay? So you could probably just follow the trend, okay? Oh, uh, maybe um, you should just take over the kitchen, okay? I cook it exactly just the way your mom loves to cook. Wait, babe, are you angry? Babe, did I say something wrong? People don't want to learn these days. But it was just so annoying. But babes, I think you're overreacting. How? If he likes it like that, then you do it like that. How about what I like? 
Ah. <laughs> I still think it's not that serious. Somebody needs to succumb. That's what marriage is about. Okay, the point is that it's not about him. It was about his mother. And if he tried my style, he might just still like it. If he tried your style. Uh -huh. <laughs> See, it's not that serious. Okay, for example, hmm? mm. I like my eggs fried on top of my noodles. Mm -hmm. Dave likes his eggs mixed into his noodles. <laughs> and I do it like that. You'd be smart and be this old. <laughs> See, hmm? when you marry somebody, you have to do a lot of things to accommodate them. I've had to change a lot to accommodate my partner. It's just what it is. Okay, look up the devil. <laughs> Hi, baby. How are you, honey? How are you? Anyway, I'm still with Toby. As soon as she leaves, I'll be on my way to you. Okay, that's why I'm even calling. Plans changed. My mom is free tomorrow and she would like to meet you over dinner. Wow. Nice. Okay. Okay, cool. Yeah, so I'll come pick you tomorrow morning, okay? Okay, my regards to be. Love you. Love you more. Bye. <gasps> Guess what? What? I'm meeting his mother tomorrow. Wow, wow, wow. That's so nice. <gasps> I know, right? So he's coming to pick me tomorrow for a dinner. <laughs> give me five, give me five, give me five. <gasps> that is a good step in the right direction. Right? Yes. See, I've always wanted to meet his mom because he's so close to her. I want to know what it is about her that he seems like he can't do without. <laughs> I can't wait to see her tomorrow. I'm so happy. I'm happy for you. Okay, we have to pick up already. Okay, okay, cheers to this. Cheers, cheers to this. this. Okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> really can't wait to meet her. <gasps> I can't believe it's happening. Yes. <gasps> I'm coming! Hi baby! Good Hello. morning! Yeah, are you ready? Yes! What do you think? Do you like? Uh. What? Yeah, baby... Can we try something else? Why? Um, it's just that my mom, you know, she won't like this. She's quite picky. <laughs> what is wrong with this dress? Honestly, baby, nothing. I actually like it. The color combination looks good with your skin, but I'm sure my mom won't like it. She usually likes those um, flay ones, you know? Uh -huh. But, um... If I like this dress, why would I want to change it? No, no, no. And guess what? I love this dress. It goes with my purse. Yeah, babe. I know, but, you know, first impressions. I want you and my mom to, like, click on your yeah. first meeting, you know? Um, can you just please change into something else? Those ones I got you the other time, change into one of them. Okay, okay, <laughs> fine, I'll, I'll change. Okay. Okay? Thanks, baby. I love you. Um, babe, just one more thing. Can you please um, wear one of those, your visible neck piece? Oh, yeah, why not? I bet you bought a lot of necklaces too, right? Oh, you see? Baby, I'm really getting to love you so much because yeah. you know my mom now. <laughs> Thanks. And, um, and you, babe, what do you like? Well, anything my mom likes. She knows best. Like, she got me this one. Yeah. <laughs> anything your mom likes. Yeah. Right. Mom knows best. Yeah, mom's always the best. Yep. Hi, baby. I'll be waiting. Mom knows best. I thought they say love is true. What I found is so untrue. 
Wanna hold you in my arms and be glad to say I am yours. Aha, uh, uh -huh, this is the contract document for Green Spring Studios. Oh, thank you. Oh, okay. Gina, you've never given me any gist about, you know, your miss dinner, meeting his mom, all those things. I have a lot of work here, yeah? but I have some time to spare. So, yeah, spill. To be, um, I think I have a big problem. With your mom? Mm -mm. With your me about his mother. Mm -hmm. I don't understand. Just listen. So, the dinner was okay, you know, but your me is something else around his mother. He means like a little puppy and its owner, you know. He paid me no attention. It was all about my mommy this, my mommy that. To be, I am dating a mommy's boy. Wow, was it that bad? It's terrible, not bad. Uh, <laughs> you don't want to see. You know, but your miss is sweet boy. But this mommy thing is just a little bit too much. I can't take it. Did you mention it to him? Not yet. I think you should mention it to him now, so that he can do better. I would love to mention it to him, but I just feel we're barely six months into the relationship. You might think I'm desperate or something. No, you need to tell him. Get it off your chest so that you guys can work towards a better future. Hmm? Okay, um, oh, I'll try. <laughs> so tell me, how is your husband? My husband? <laughs> That oh, one, he's okay. Marriage no be being so, girl. See, now that I'm in it, I know better. Better know that one now and no peace. Uh, no problem. Let me experience it first and I'll know better for myself. Oh. Anyway, shall I let me go back to work? Uh, okay, let me go need this file. The car here. Ah, mom. It was just yesterday I was at your place. Maybe I should just pack my loads and just move it to your house so you'll be happy. <laughs> uh, yes, yes, yes. I'm at Gina's place right now. Yeah, we went out last night. I even got tipsy. Mommy, yesterday was wild. Like, really, really wild. <laughs> uh, yes, yes, they sent me the money. I will transfer it to you after this call before I forget. <laughs> yes, uh, okay, okay. I will stop by at your place before I go to mine. All right, I love you. All right, bye bye, old double. <laughs> this is what the. <laughs> but, babe, you didn't need to tell your mom about last night. That was unnecessary. Ah, I tell her everything, no. <laughs> no, but you should have some level of privacy to yourself. Privacy. Yes. <laughs> She's my mom. The same person that sat and watched my infant hair. I tell her everything, you know. I tell her about my income, my expenses, my even my diet plans, everything. Yeah. In fact, let me even send her that money now before I forget. No, no, no. You want to send your salary to your mother? Yeah. She helps me with my savings. At this age, you want to send your salary to your mother's account? What happens to your own account? Okay. Trust me, yeah. My mom is not just even saving it that she helps me with. She helps me plan how I spend it properly. So I don't waste my money. Uh, you don't see anything wrong with that? What could be wrong with it? She's my mom. You mean? No, no, no. This is serious. You are 35 years old. You should be able to make plans and decisions for yourself. But my mom is good at it. She's even very much better than anyone. You are an adult. Even you, she's better at it than you. There's nothing, baby, look, just stop, okay? It's not that serious. So take it, it is that serious, Yomi. Grow up. Come on. <sighs> I'm marveled. Babe, I said it's not that serious. Stop. Uh, you're beginning to sound like my ex. This is exactly what she was doing and I didn't like. <sighs> look, there's nothing wrong in my mom helping me to plan my savings and be involved in everything that concerns me. I'm, I'm, I'm marveled. I can't believe this. What happens to you 
Growing no, up. Stop. It's okay. I don't want to hear this again. But stop it. Okay. Okay. Fine. No. Stop. No, I'm serious. Okay. I don't. Okay. Don't. 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 Just leave her alone. I don't. have a mommy too. And you know? what? It's okay. Deal with your mom. Do I? Do I come between okay, you fine. and your mom? Do I? Do I tell you anything about you when you talk to your mom? Did I? Do, do, do I come into it? Why are you coming into this now? What's wrong there? She's my mom. For God's sake. <laughs> stop it. I'm, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not feeling this. So I, I don't like it at all. You're going to have kids too on your own. What was that? Is anyone stopping you from it's loving okay, you? Enough, enough, please. It's fine. When I was saying enough, did you hear me? Jeez, I can't believe this. Ha! Give me a moment. Now. I honestly don't know. Oh. Maybe it's the battery. Oh yeah, I think it's the battery. It is, right? Yeah, I think we may need to charge the battery or look for someone to help us like charge it up. Okay. Right? Um, you know what? Let me just call my mom. Call your mom for what? You should be calling a mechanic and not your mother. You me? Yeah. What is going on here? You need a mechanic and not your mother. Babe, trust me, eh? Both of us combined. We don't know half of what my mom knows. Are you serious now? Really? Yeah. Babe, what are you doing? Babe? Grabbing a taxi because I won't stand here and allow you to waste my time. Really? When you're not calling your mother, she's going to advise you to talk to the mechanic, right? And then you're going to wait for her to send you money to pay the mechanic again, right? Not me. Goodbye. Hey, Gina! Gina! Nonsense. Call your mother! Ah! What's wrong with this lady up nowadays? Just act anyhow. What's this? What's this? Hello? Mom? You hear me? I don't know. I don't know. Today's just anyhow. My car broken down No, You can't just pour it on the road. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Eh? What's this? What will I do now? I don't know. I beg. Please. Um, I don't know. How you, are you going to come? You don't see. I kid you not, babe. I mean, this is not funny. Seriously. You obviously do not know him too well. That boy is fully dependent on his mother. <laughs> he can't make no decision without his mother's opinion or approval. He said that my mommy said this or my mommy said that. Man, he's such a mommy's boy. <sighs> wow. That's bad. Did you say that is bad? This is very, very annoying. So we don't you get? <laughs> Oh well, he's in a relationship now, so all this should stop. Should I talk to him about it? I really don't know, you know, man. I don't know how he's gonna feel if you talk to him. Maybe you shouldn't. Huh? Don't talk to him. All right. I believe he'll change. Let's just give it some time and keep our fingers crossed. Okay, yeah? if you say so. Let's just wait then. All right. No, wahala, babe. I've heard you. All right, Lita, bye. Are you like this because of what happened the other day? Yes. Listen, Yumi. We can't pretend as though nothing happened. Okay? I'm really getting tired of all this mommy things. It's tiring. All 
I'm just trying to say it's for you to understand that you can be yourself without your mother. Babe. All I'm trying to say is that you should, should learn to do without your mom a little bit. I know, I know you love her a lot, okay? But you mean you're a full grown man and soon you're gonna start your own family. Are you going to expect your mom to come home and make your decisions for you? But all the decisions she has made on my behalf ended up being beneficial to me. I know your mother is smart and intelligent. And you trust her judgments and opinions very well. I, I also do. All I'm just saying is for you to be able to make that decisions by yourself as well. Just, just learn to, to, to be yourself. Do the things that you like as well. Yeah, are you by any means trying to separate me and my mom? No, never. I would never do that, Yumi. I know you love your mother so much and I know you guys are very close. But look at you now. You, you, you're grown, Yumi. You're no longer that 15 years old boy that always needs his mother for everything. You can also learn to do your things your own way. You can as well just be yourself. Just learn it, baby. You can, okay? Okay, I'm not, I'm not trying to make you upset or something. Just trying to understand me. I love you, but I want you to be yourself and take your decisions and be a man. Come on, please. Okay. I agree. Are you going to try it for me? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Come here. Give me a big smile. Good. <gasps> I love you. <laughs> you know you could just be happy like that. Okay. I honestly don't know why she would say that. Like, seriously. I told you the other day she got mad that I called you and told you when my car broke down. Yeah, she was like, ah, why did you call your mom? Do you call your mom for everything? Oh, your mom is this, everything. You do this, you do that. Like, she thinks you're controlling me. Hmm. Well, honestly, yeah. I don't know. This one, she's already behaving like this. Are you sure she will ever submit to you? I don't know. I don't know why these women cannot just understand that you're my everything and that there's nothing they can do to change that. It's crazy, you. Okay, yeah, I'll call you back. I love you. Bye. What's going on? I, I came as soon as you called. It's the ulcer. Wow. <gasps> sorry, sorry. Is it that serious? Okay, we need to go to the hospital right now. Okay? Please. Sit up. Try to sit up so I can get you there. <gasps> oh, wow. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Hold on. Hold on. Sorry, just hold on a bit, okay? Hello? Mom? Yeah, 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 yeah. What? He did that? He won't try it. He does not have the nerves for that. You can't do it. What, you're alone? Um, you want me to come? Oh, mom, mom, mom. Uh, um, I was about to take Gina to the hospital right now. Oh, but don't worry, it's fine. I'll come, okay? I'll come. I'll be there right now. Okay. Mom, what are you doing? 
I won't call um, Toby to come get you. Take no, you to the no, hospital. No, no, baby, please. I need to. I need to be at the hospital now. Yeah, baby. See, my my mom's landlord is is, is trying to act funny and I can't. Please. She's all alone. Baby. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, okay, please. She's just alone. If it wasn't this serious, I, I won't leave you. I swear. Please, you just please. hold on, baby. Uh, Toby is coming right now. Hello, Toby. Toby, please. Uh, I need you at the house. Now. situation that I saw you. You would have at least taken me to the hospital before going to see his mom. What do you want me to say? I don't know. I'm anyway, sorry. Thanks for yesterday. Girl, it's nothing. I'm the one that introduced you to this, I don't know. It's not your fault. Hey. Wrong. <laughs> you left your girlfriend in pain instead of taking her to the hospital. Ah, but I called you to go help her. I explained this thing to you now. I told you my mother needed me, it was urgent. Uh, and your girlfriend's situation wasn't urgent? Ah, are you even serious right now? I'm so disappointed in you. You know what? Enough. Enough of this whole mommy obsession. Because I can't put up with this anymore. <sighs> what, what are you saying? All this is unnecessary now. What were you expecting? Were you expecting me to abandon my mom for you? Are you joking? Of course I am not joking. Because your mother is the lord of your life. And of course you will choose her over your wife. And in the future, she will make decisions for your marriage and your home. But guess what? I can't put up with that anymore. I'd rather a grown up, real man in my life. In that case, this relationship is over. Fine. You know, fine, because we'll keep having issues over my mom. And you know, nothing, no one can replace her. Not even you. Not even a wife. Fine! Go marry your mother. Go make her a wife. Go! Go and miss her for a breast milk, you, you grown ass man. You will disgrace the man and I hate you. I hate you. I'm sorry. It's not even worth it. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> It's not worth it. It's not worth it at all. I thought they say love is true. What I found is so untrue. Wanna hold you in my arms and be glad to say I am yours. Mm. I thought they say love is real. Too bad that's not how I feel Been searching far too long For someone who was specially made for me I was all alone, your love came and you found me You saw my bleeding heart, your love came and you healed me Now I believe in love again Love you more till the end. I think you I'm at a hotel. Where is Miss Pauline? Conference room. Okay, I'm coming. Hello. Hello, hi, hi, how are you doing? Hi. Yeah, I'm Alex, nice to meet you. Um, Gina, 
Gina, that's a beautiful name. Thank you. Um, I don't normally do this, actually, just so you know. I mean, what exactly? You know, see a beautiful woman and run after her and start talking to her. Okay. <laughs> I don't normally do this, but... He is so cute. <sighs> um, uh, I hope you don't mind me asking, are you here to see someone? No, I'm actually here for a business meeting. Oh. And I have to run because I'm late. Sure, I'll wait for you. Seriously? Yes. Let's see how that goes. Don't worry, I'll wait. Yummy. It looks really nice, huh? Wait till you taste it. This? Oh, spaghetti. Okay. Mm, it smells really nice. Tastes even better. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. I'm just gonna eat a little because I'm not hungry. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Just that? Where's your meat? I took this. I don't want to ignore it. That's so it? Like, okay, let me just taste the food first. Oh, you don't trust that it's <laughs> No, wonderful. it's not like that. I'm That's not really hungry. This fast when you have your best now. Thank you, darling. Nice. The food is delicious, believe me. Okay. Hey, calm down. <laughs> it's a fact. You know? Wow! <laughs> it's so good. So mm. good. <laughs> I like it. Really nice. Glad you like it. Mm. You know, I can cook better than most women, actually. You know, because women care about their nails more than making mm. a good meal that's edible. Mm. <laughs> you know, how do you make a good wife if you can't even cook? You know? <laughs> okay, but me, I don't think cooking is the basis to to judge a woman or to measure her wife material. What? I mean, a lot of women are willing to learn how to cook. Learn so a guy yeah. should teach a girl how to cook. Like Doesn't that's matter. that's disgraceful, babe. <laughs> but you can cook, right? No, I can't. Whoa. <laughs> of course I can cook better than you can. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I'm not sure about that. But you can cook? Yes. You can cook better than me. We have to see and prove. You are so proud. What is going on? <laughs> Baby, I'm just a scared mm. human being. Okay, cheers. Cheers, baby. Mm. Mm. Oh my god. Let's cheer sauce. <laughs> you a clown. <laughs> Come on, eat now. You already drinking. Okay. Enjoy with my sweats. Okay. 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 Really, this is really nice. Nice. Oh. Mm, I'm really good. I'm so good. Mm. I'm the best. Mm. Mm. You're so proud. <laughs>
Okay, I love you. Bye, miss you. I love you too. <laughs> Who was that? <laughs> you were. Are you a watchman? <laughs> Who was that? It's um, it's Alex. The guy I told you about. The one that you met three weeks ago? Yes, yes. You're already dating. I think we have a great chemistry. How about Gina now? We spoke about this. You know, you were supposed to take time off from the last relationship. You need time to heal before <laughs> getting into a new relationship. I need time to heal. I they seek. I they seek for your eye. I beg, time is ticking. We move, okay? We move. No, Gina, come on. Remember, garbage in, garbage out. You don't even know this guy well enough. So because I did it some losers, I should wallow in depression. Oh. Baby girl. This guy is smart. He's hardworking. He's not a mommy boy like that useless you me boy. You know, he, 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 he's very articulate. I think he's okay. You know, I should give him a chance. But I still think it's too fast. It's still too early. Well, I don't think so. Because, you know, Alex, like I said, he's, he's cool. I feel like I'm dating a real man now. A real man yeah, now. Yeah, he's always talking about future, you know, married, settling down, how many kids, kind of talk, you know. I should give him a chance now. What do you think? I don't talk, Amo. No do like saying no here. Thank you, Ma, for your advices. Mm, make this one last, Sha. You're so sweet. I don't talk, Amo. Oh, Seriously. I feel like the queen just said this. You're making me blush, stop. Look at you, even the way you walk. Hey, babe, come here, come here. What? Now, Christoph, looking at you, you know that, right? Caught me looking at you a couple of times, but I'm gonna take my eyes off of you. Honestly, you're everything I want in a woman. Alex, I, I think I'm falling for you. Deeply. I want something serious with you. Okay, I want to set some down with you. I want kids. <sighs> We can do this, right? We can make it work. Yeah. I love you so much. Our kids are going to be so handsome and beautiful. <laughs> yes. <laughs> True. They would be very beautiful. How many do you want? Two? I don't know. Three? Yeah. Three's perfect. Three? Yeah. We're having three then. Two boys and a girl. Three's fine. All right, we'll have three then. Okay. Two boys and a girl. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah, you were so sweet. You were so sweet. Don't look at me that way. You make me blush. Let's go upstairs. Past ten already. Okay, ten you, used to, already? Yeah, you used to be up and about. You know? And I need you to do uh this laundry before she goes for me before the sun goes down, you know, so it's so dry. Um, um okay, um just put them in the laundry machine, I'll take them out and dry them. No, 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 if I put this in the laundry machine, it's going to shrink most of these, you know, it's just going to bleed like it's going to mess them up, you know. So, nah, just use your hand. Don't be lazy, baby. Come on. Um, 
Okay, um, why don't I just sort out the, the ones that are very fragile and uh, put the rest in the, in the machine? No, I don't use the machine for any of my clothes, babe. Okay, I don't. I mean, it just ruins them, you know? And I like using my hands. As a woman, you should be able to use your hands as well. Why do you have a laundry machine? Who says I have a laundry machine? You know what? I'll just do it myself. Oh, uh, it's okay. No, I, I might as well do it myself. I mean, the laundry machine has made people lazy, you know? And I wonder how people are coping before the laundry machine came about. No, it's okay. I, I was just wondering why you don't have a laundry machine. And uh, I mean, it's been a long time. I wash clothes with my bare hands. But that's fine. I'll take care of that for you. So you do it? Great. I'll bring okay. the soap and bleach. Do you need uh, fabric whitener? Uh, I'll just bring everything. Bring everything. All right, great. Great. You look beautiful, baby. But babe, I was I was watching something else. Hmm? Yes, I was watching a movie. You can watch it after I finish watching what I'm watching. It's cool. No, you should have just said excuse me or something. What are you talking about? What's your issue that I changed the channel? Why are you trying to nag over the TV? I don't understand. What's your this issue? This is not fair. This is not the first time you're doing oh my this. Gosh. Huh? It's not fair. Yes. So I can't change the channel on my own TV. I just say simple excuse. What happened to having good manners? Whoa. I need to have manners so I can change oh the channel on the TV I bought, the subscription I bought, the internet connection I bought, the chair I bought, the makeup on your face I bought, the nails that you're using to Jesus change the channel I bought. has got nothing to do with the internet or the TV or the... It's just everything to do with this. What are you talking about? What, courtesy? So you're trying to school me. You're my teacher. Wow. Yeah? I mean, I'm, I'm a secondary school boy or what? I don't understand okay, what's going you're on. You're wearing the context, house and the relationship. Okay? Is that what it is? I'm taking it as a, you're wearing the trousers in a relationship now. You're the man, I'm the woman. That's what you're trying to say. It's like, what is wrong with you? I don't need to be around you right now, okay? I hate your energy right now. I don't need to be around negative energy. I came in positive, now I'm angry. This is negative. This, this is not that serious. Just come back and... It's, what, what, is, what is wrong with you? You are so impossible. Just a simple excuse. Is that a big deal to do? Please come and watch. I don't want to watch. Come and watch, yo. Come and watch, please. Come and watch. Come and take your TV, no problem. What? This is a big red flag. My sister, you better find your square root while it's still early. Oh, maybe I overreacted. I shouldn't have reacted the way I did. No. From what you told me, he looks like an authoritative man. But you can't just make conclusions from the fact that he changed the channels on me. After you ended up apologizing. Flag for what? He was the one that was supposed to apologize to you. But to be if apologizing to your partner make your relationship work. Why not? Even if he's wrong, <laughs> if you continue like this, you continue like this in marriage. Toby, I mean, saying sorry doesn't kill anyone, okay? Listen, Alex loves me and he wants to marry me. I can't jeopardize it because of this little issue. Girl, your desperation is becoming alarming. You'll fall into the wrong hands, Joe. <sighs> Listen, I beg, I beg, I beg, Toby. Where are you? In your husband's house, Abby? Mm. And I just clocked 34. So I shouldn't be desperate. I shouldn't. I don't blame you. Hi, babe. Is your friend still there? <laughs> Hi, but babe, relax now. As soon as she leaves, I'll be on my way, okay? <sighs> Am I interrupting anything? Toby, he's just missing me. What is it? He wants to spend time with me, and besides, I'm going there tonight. Calm down. Why do I feel like he's trying to monitor you? What is going on here? Is it that you don't like my boyfriend? Do you have a problem with him? No, it's not that. I've been here for barely two hours, and he has called four times. So? Ah. You know what? Let's just change the topic before I break somebody's head. Please. Who's head? So, tell me, how is the new branch doing? It's okay. It's doing well. It's doing well. 
And meanwhile, you told me you were going to tell me something. Mm -hmm. So spill, what is it? I don't know. Um, did he buy you a new car? What? You're pregnant. You're pregnant. Ah! You're pregnant! Come here! Oh, congratulations, darling. Congratulations. I'm going to be an auntie. Is he a boy or a girl? I'm lying. No. <laughs> Congrats, go <Kogi>. here. <laughs> oh my god, look at this woman, she's gonna be a mother. Yeah. I'm so happy for you. <sighs> Somebody's mother. <laughs> <laughs> right, you're, you're, you're right, you're right. Oh yeah, come on, we're going to meet my brother. <laughs> oh, no, this boyfriend. Oh. Hey baby. Oh, there you are. Hi. Come here. Don't bring my remotes. Why, why are you jumping on my remote like that? Come on, are you huh? okay? Why okay. are you okay. cold? Why are you asking me if I'm okay? That's a. I'm going to be honest with you because I care about you. That's a very stupid question. You were supposed to be here hours ago. I just pulled it up now and you're asking me if I'm okay. What kind of stupid question is that? But babe, but come on, I explained to you I, I had a visitor, right? My friend came around and you know, girls, geez, we get talking and talking. You guys work in the same company. <sighs> the same company. What are you talking about? We used to work in the same company, but she's now in a different branch. I hardly see her. Okay, so it's busting my mind right now that you're trying to justify that she's more important to you than me. That's what you're trying to say. How can your friend be more important to you than me? I Doesn't haven't said that. Why are you talking like this, babe? Come on, I'm sorry. What I'm here now, right? I'm here to spend the night with you. Come on. Okay, I'm sorry, Chara. Chara, please. It won't happen again. Okay, baby. I don't even know what you guys are talking about. That took so long. Like, what, what are you guys talking about? You just talk girl, talk. girl talk? And she knows you're supposed to come see your man and she's using girl talk to hold you back? You shouldn't be friends with this girl. You shouldn't. Alex Tobi is my only friend, my best friend. The one am I? See, that's the issue. Because you sacrifice time for her, but you don't for me. Because she's your best friend. I should be your best friend. If you're in a relationship and you're invested in the relationship, I should be your best friend, oh, your partner. Babe, this is different. Tobi is it's my childhood friend. We've been friends from days. It's not like that. Okay. We're going to have issues. I'm being honest with you. Oh. We're going to have issues in this relationship if you keep going against my orders. Okay? Oh. It's I'm not, telling you uh, that she is not a good friend to you because she is married and she knows that you're uh, not married and she's holding uh, you back from getting a man that will marry Alex, you. Alex, she is a nice person. It doesn't person. listen. You need to stop seeing her. And I'm being honest with you. Before you came here, I was looking forward to seeing you, but now your touch even makes my skin curl. I just have to accept Alex as he is and manage him. <sighs> hey, what's up? You're sleeping? No, just resting. Oh, um, pick the one you like. Uh, okay, um, this is beautiful. The shape, especially. Yeah. yeah. This one. Okay, silver or gold? Isn't this supposed to come like a surprise? He says I'm proposing now. <laughs> I just want to know your preference, you know. <laughs> okay. Um, I think I will go for dun, 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 silver. Did you just do eating mini man anymore? <laughs> silver, silver yeah? yes. All right, babe. Give me cheek, give me cheek. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, ah. See you in a bit. Oh. 
Nice. That actually looks nice. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. That. You know, anytime you display your skills, culinary wise, you know, I'm reminded why I should hurry up and marry you. <laughs> Thank you, babe. You're special, you're different. You expecting anyone? No. Who's that knocking on the door like a mad person? I have no idea. I'll just check. Huh? Hold on. Did I do something to you? Why are you avoiding me? Uh, Alex, um, good afternoon. You didn't tell me you were coming. How is that possible? I've been calling you. Did I do something wrong? Go! Nice. Um, no, 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 no. I've, I've just been very busy. Busy? Okay. We do not work on Saturdays and Sundays. And I've been calling you countlessly. You've not even returned one of my phone calls. Oh, you can't play. It, it was weekend. I chose to spend it with my man and I didn't want no distractions. Distractions? Me? Solid player. Solid player. Um, Even though this guy was a solid player. Um, Toby, maybe he should just leave. I'll, I'll call you. Chinga now. <sighs> what did I do? This is my first time expecting and I really need my friend. I need you. <laughs> um, I said I will call you. Just just leave now. Okay? I should yes. leave. Yes. Lissandro! Come on, Tim Leg! Nonsense! Look at the door to the mosquitoes. See the kind of friends that you keep, just barges in like an animal. She's, she's knocking like she owns the place. Does she pay your rent? Does she pay your rent? Because this is the kind of weeds in your life that we need to weed out of your life, okay? Because you have a beautiful face, you have a beautiful soul, you have a beautiful life, but you just suffocate it with things that shouldn't be there. It's okay. You should just eat your chicken, okay? I'm sorry about that. Okay, cool. I'm sorry about that. She's sorry. She's a sorry human being. Okay? You don't need people like that in your life. Grab one. No, you first. Go ahead. Okay, I'll just feed you then. I'll take a bite. Do you like it? I love it. What are you watching? The greatest football club ever known to man, Manchester United. <laughs> As always. As always. <laughs> I didn't. That's exactly what you did. Baby, um, 
I'm sorry. I know I haven't been taking your calls and text messages. But it's not me, it's Alex. He's always around me most of the time and he's always snooping through my phone. So he's the reason why you're acting like this? <sighs> to be... <sighs> this is hard. Um, it feels that like Alex doesn't want us to be friends. And what? I don't know, it's, it's not like that, okay? Um, we're still friends. So you're choosing a man over our friendship? No, Toby, I will never do that, okay? Listen, I'm not ending our friendship. Just that we can keep it low for now. I'm glad your leave is over, so I get to see you up at work. Stop now. I've missed you. Look at you. I've missed you too. Good job. I've missed you. But why are you letting him control you? What reason does he even have for us not being friends? That's the point. Men are different. It's not just you. He doesn't want me to have female friends. Well, he has friends. He believes that all we women do is gossip and being envious of each other. He has friends, doesn't he? Can we cannot not talk about him, please? Oh. Look. What? He proposed. Wow! Gina! Oh my god! This is all... <laughs> this is what you've always wanted. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. I know, right? It's too fast. We're barely seven months in the relationship, but he proposed and I want to get married. Why not? <laughs> Let me see again. Beautiful, right? Yeah, he tried. <laughs> Thank you. To be have missed you. I miss you. Look at you. How many months gone are you? I'm seven months. Seven already? Yes, I'm seven months. Time months. Mm -hmm. mm. So you just have two months left. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. I've been so much. So, no, you still have the glow. <laughs> Yeah, we're setting out with the boys. We're going to get a few drinks. You know, I will be back here later on, so just make sure there's food for everybody, okay? Why are you breathing like that? You're breathing like we're just building a house. <laughs> Is that a thank you I'm supposed to get? Or oh, well done at least. Thank you, baby. Come on, it's just pounding you out. It's not a big deal, you know? I mean, ladies back in the day, do you know what they had to go through? They used to fetch water from the river and walk all the way wherever their house is, or from the borehole, and then they would chop wood, fire wood, carry it on their head and go and cook. Baby, come on, now. Alex, I am not from those days, okay? This is 21st century. If I wanted to eat pounded yam, I would just buy a yam flour and mix. But you insisted that I pound yam for you, and I did. Yes, I insist, baby. Okay, because that powder thing is it's chemicals. People eat it. Well, lazy people do. You know? Lazy people do. Don't be lazy, baby. Come on. Me, lazy. Yeah, Me, Alex. Alex. Alex, I am not lazy. Alex, I cook for you every single weekend. I do your laundry with my big hands. Alex, you don't do nothing in this house. You don't help me. You're not domestic. You don't even wash the plates you use and eat and you do nothing. Because it's not my duty. It's your duty as a woman to do all those things. And it's yeah, my duty. Domestic. No, it's my duty to provide. I, I provide, okay? Domestic men are men I don't provide. Yeah, I provide. Okay, I'm very proud of that. Don't worry, you get used to it by the time we get married, okay? I need to head out now. I'll be back in a bit, okay? I'll call you when we're coming back so you want me for Today. Yeah, you said so. Are I they already so. on their way? Yeah, they're on their way. Oh, nice. Wait, so you didn't take a day off? She was taking a day off to take care of them when they get here. That's protocol. That's where it should be. I should take a day off because the people are coming? Yeah. Big boy at work, they don't give such permissions. And even if my parents are coming, I will still go to work. Even if your parents were coming, you would go to work? Of course. Why would I go to work? I don't know how other people were raised, but I was raised 
with respect. Are you serious now? Yes, I was raised with the Igbo principles as pillars in my childhood, okay? Oh. They laid the foundation properly to grow my character properly, okay? And these people that did all this work on me are going to be your in-laws very soon. Do you get me? So you need more respect, baby. That's what I'm saying. I understand, but baby, I have to go to work, okay? And, and babe, you, you know you work almost from home all week, you know, right? So why don't you just take care of them? Then I take over when I come back from work. This is only going on because it's going on for a little bit. Once we get married, you're stopping at work. So. <sighs> did, I, did I hear you right? Yes, you heard me right. I, I'm going to quit my job. Of course you have to. I'm not going to let you have a boss that has more power over you than me. You rather obey him than obey me. That's what happened. He has to quit that job. I'm not kidding. I'm not doing nannies. Okay, what, what's going to happen when the kids come? You're taking care of kids. No nannies. No, no, Alex, you're joking. You are joking. I'm not joking. Baby, you know I love you, right? But I love my job, too. <laughs> Have a nice day. I'll talk to you later. Don't let it be a laugh now. I'm to something, okay? I've told you. Okay? Who do you love more? Your husband or your work? No nannies. So you quit your job, right? Never. Never. I know how much work I put in to get here. I can't quit my job just to become a full-time housewife. Not Gina. I can't do that. So what will you do? No more. Well, when I get home, I'm going to try to talk to him and convince him and talk sense into him, you know. I mean, Look at the situation of the country. Are we going to depend only on his income? Okay, what if he insists? Gina, I don't even think you have a choice. Is this what you want for yourself? I know, Toby. But no one is perfect, okay? Look at all the other guys I dated. Nothing to write home about. Mm. But Alex is authoritative. He's selfish. And he's a control freak. I know, but Alex is still manageable. If I leave him, who knows what nest is waiting for me? Gina, as your friend, eh? I can't tell you what to do. I just hope you don't regret this decision. But what? what oh God, I don't even know what to do. But I can't quit my job for him. Look at my office. How can I leave my work? How can I leave this big office? You've worked too hard. I can't. Ah. Everyone has a comma. You can't find a perfect person. You can't. coming from work. That's not true. The work closed three hours ago, even though you left two hours ago. That's what my source told me. Yeah, Alex, I left the office a bit late because the drivers kept cancelling on me. You know the Uber surge when it's late hours. That's a lie. Okay, that's an excuse. It's a lie. That's the truth. And then the road was choked up, the traffic and all of that. <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Did you say that your source told you? Mm -hmm. Wait, I guess, I guess spying on me. You have to spy on you, okay? I can't have a woman disgrace me, okay, over nonsense. And you said you left since, so this whole traffic thing you're talking about is a lie. Alex, no, wait, wait a minute. You paid someone to spy on me. What sort of insecurity is that? Like, where would I possibly go after work? Where? You purposely came back late <sighs> so you would avoid your duties as my wife-to-be because my uncles are here. What is there to avoid? It's not just to simply give them food and water. Alex, please don't be really close. I am tired, it's exhausted, please. Wait, wait, who, who are you talking to? <clears throat> Did you just try to slap me? And I will actually slap you if you don't bring your voice down and head upstairs quietly, okay? Because a slap is reserved for a woman that's not respecting her husband. Now you listen to me. The fact that I tolerate all your excesses doesn't make me dummy. If you ever raise your hand on me, I swear to God, you will rot in jail for physical assault. First of all, bring your voice down before you wake up my uncles. And don't you ever speak to me in this manner again. Okay. 
You go wife your uncles. I'm done. What are you talking about? What's this? Why are you being extra? My ex and I used to fight all the time. We break table, but we never broke up. To hell with you and your ex. What are you talking about? Gina, if you walk out of that door, don't ever walk back. Gina, don't close that door. Months I got engaged and I'm back to square one. If we are pregnant, it lasted longer than my relationship. Is it a golden ingredient husband for me? Is it that I'm destined to, to die alone, to grow old alone and die? Is it it? Stop saying all this nonsense now. Just stop it. Why even wearing black and black? Because my heart is dead and buried. I can love, love anybody again in my life. You no, make me cry. Oh. Stop it now. You know what? I am done with men. I'm just going to opt for an IVF and get myself a baby before I click menopause. Because I don't have a man. <laughs> who is that? Don't worry, don't worry. Just put your face together. Let me see who that is. Who the hell is that? What do you want? What kind of stupid question is that? Can I ask you what's the house? Huh? Better mind your step, okay? Stay silent. Baby, no. You heard her. Get out. What? Get out does mean it. Are you talking to me? I came here to make up with you because I know you miss me. What do you mean I should get... Why are you touching me? Please, be going. Hmm? Just leave. Listen, I know you have a human being in your stomach, but I don't care. I will do bad things to you. <laughs> do not touch me. Bad things to me? <laughs> so you want to beat both of us as we are like this? You this shameless idiot. Woman bitter. Listen, Alex. I want to, I know, listen, calm down first of all. You heard her. Leave this minute before I do something stupid. You're talking to me. Leave! Oh my god. Leave this minute, Alex! I am gonna break somebody's head if you don't leave this minute! Huh. Alex! Now leave this minute. Get out of my house! Get out! I hate you, leave! Leave, you heard me! Leave my house, you heard me! Just get out! Get out, you poor bitch, leave! Hey, leave! Hey, 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 hold on. Listen, leave my listen, house, listen, leave! Listen, listen to me. You want me to leave? I don't have energy for your bullshit. <gasps> I'll leave. So I hate come, you. Don't come running back. I hate you. Get out. Hey. <gasps> Be going. Now. Get out. I hate you. That's the dog. Catch. Don't oh. tell me. <laughs> Wait, I think my water just broke. Yeah. I just need to get my car key. <laughs> Sponsors for the Happy Feet project are ready for a presentation. Okay. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. If you're not ready, ma'am, we can go through it again. You know this deal means a lot to us. Trust me when I say I'm ready. Shall we? Alright, ma'am. Shall we? Here we go. Sorry. Okay, so let's get into the presentation proper. Okay. 
So, um, the Happy Fit Project is a project that uh, we intend to use to encourage people, you know, little organizations growing up, small companies trying to find their feet in the public. So, the essence of it is to be the standard for our country, such that every other country can colonize, collaborate with us, such as Britain, Russia, America, Egypt, every one of them can come together and work with us. We have standard and build a JV top organization to make sure that everyone can really That is the end of this presentation and uh, we hope that you collaborate with us and uh, get back to us soon. Thank you. What a powerful presentation. Absolutely. I mean, we are I found it really hard comporting myself in there, you know. I wanted to hug you so bad. <laughs> I know, right? When I saw you, I was like, ooh, you know, he's here. I would have called it nonsense if someone tells me that I will see you again. I know, such a small <laughs> word. Yeah. Look at you, you look good. And you too, you look good. Thank you. Mm, how long has it been? I don't um, know. 15, 20? 20, 20 maybe. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the last memory I have of us was when you rejected the love letter <laughs> I wrote you. I, mean, I did? You tore it. Yes, you did. <laughs> you know, you were a distraction. You were writing Wayek, remember? I remember. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> I know. Oh, it's really good to see you. So good to see you too. So, um, how about your friend? Uh, what's her name? Toby? Yes, Toby. She was your best friend. Right? Oh, she's still my best friend. <laughs> wow. And she works here too. She just put to bed three months ago, so she's on leave. Wow, that's great. Yeah. Please send my congratulations. She will. Yeah. Good. Okay, uh, so good to see you. Yeah, Look at you. Me. Oh, good. Oh, 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 yeah. Come on. Are you actually going to live like that? I mean, we need to catch up. You know, go for a date or something. Oh, really? I I'm going to be very busy, you know. All through the week. And next week, too. Sorry. Okay, that's fine. Um, how about you give me your number and I'll call you. Is that okay? Okay. See you. Take care. Alright. Minutes, but guess what? I just let it ring, you know. Who has time for that? <laughs> ah, babes, but that's not fair. Zeno was a really great guy back then. Uh. Dude was really crazy about you. Hmm. All the men crazy about me did what? Drove me crazy. This girl, just give him a chance, okay? If he's still professing love for you up until now, maybe there's something there. I bet, I bet, I bet. I am not interested, and I made it clear to him, okay? You see, Tobit, this past three months of my life has been the most peaceful without any man in my corner. But you need somebody, Gina. We all do. Tobit, 
what I need is a baby. I'm not a man. Guess what? I'm already saving and planning for the IVF. And once I'm ready, I'm getting it done. Ha. Ha. Are you sure you really want to do this? My mind is made up 100%. Okay. If that's what you want. Mm -hmm. That's what I want. And that's on period. I think that's my, my godson doing. <laughs> that one. I just managed to make him sleep. Oh, Let me not raise my voice too much. Thank you, little angel. Kiss it for me, okay? Alright then, bye. Who has said all this useless man? What fish? How did you get my address? Um, I was able to contact Tobe and she... Of course, it has to be her. Ah. Oh, nice place. Ah, thank you. Sit down. Oh, thank you. <laughs> what do you want? Um, you've been avoiding my calls for weeks since the last time we met. Come on, Gina. We're no longer in secondary school. We're not writing work anymore. Listen. Don't you have feelings for me? Zino, Zino, I thought I made it clear to you that I'm not ready for any serious relationship. I'm not ready to commit to any man at the moment. I've been thinking about you. Seeing you the other time ignited all the feelings I had for you. Bury those feelings, okay? Listen, I may be attracted to you, but I'm not ready to commit to anyone. Listen, I've been through a whole lot. A whole, whole lot. All I want to do right now is have fun. That's all. How do you mean? You know, Friends with benefits. I mean, we can friends, have fun, hang out, just without commitments, okay? That's all I can do right now. Listen, hey, that's not what I want. Hmm, what do you want then? Listen, I, I want to love you. <laughs> I want to be committed to you. I want to start up a family with you. I want to settle down. That's what I want. Um, Mizino, please leave. Um, are you serious right now? Leave. <sighs> you want me to go? Mm -hmm. Are you actually going to leave? 
Come here. What? You mean you guys are just friends with benefits? Yes, yeah, so I guess what? We're enjoying it. And ah. it's cool with it too. Wait, but all you guys do is have sex. <laughs> yes, we have a whole lot of sex. But sometimes we also hang out, but no love talk, you know, just about friendship, no commitment. And it's so fun. Gina. <sighs> Gina, I know you. What? This is not what you want. Oh, Toby, please don't start. I beg. I'm happy like that. After I give love my best shot and you feel with me, right? Mm. But I know you like this, you know, guy. I'm not going to deny that. I mean, who wouldn't like Zeno? You know, you know, he's, he's handsome, he's smart, he's cool, he's a gentleman. Mm. And guess what? what? He is so good. He's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> what? The guy would not kill me. <laughs> hmm. Okay. I beg, I beg, I beg. Don't, don't go on bury me next time. I'm giving life what you gave me back. Okay, I just. Okay. Please. Okay. <laughs> oh my God, let's go grab some ice cream, Jerry. <laughs> You're feeling good, too. <laughs> I feel so good with my life, girl. <laughs>
feels so good. Uh huh. Oh. Mm. <laughs> right there. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Got yeah. it. Thank you. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. Relaxing. Feel good. Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> you were so sweet. You were so sweet today, baby. <laughs> <laughs> and I can't tell you off of you. Stop! Now. Don't kill me. Oh, come on, I want more. <laughs> oh, stop! Come here. Come, come. You want to give some ah. data? <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Yeah. Oh, come on, Selena, don't say that. Oh, yeah, listen, you should wear those bikini more often, okay? They look so sweet and sexy on you. All right. Oh, come on. Turn around, let me see your waist. Oh, my God. <laughs> you are beautiful. I can't wait to see you soon. Yes, of course, soon. <laughs> Okay, baby. I like what I see. This is not part of the plan, but I can't help it. Listen, I, I want you to be my wife so badly. Will you marry me, Gina? <sighs> Zina, what is the meaning of this rubbish? We had an agreement, right? No commitment or anything of this sort. So what is going on here? I want more. Right. Yes. I've always wanted more. Listen, I'm tired of this whole game. I'm tired. It's been one year. One year doing this so-called friends who benefit with you. Come on, I'm tired. You know what, just, just stand up, okay? Just stand up. Listen, the answer is capital no. Even in a thousand years to come, I will never marry you. Okay then, I'll just walk away. Fine. I can't do this anymore. I can't. I'm going to block your number. So we don't get in touch anymore. Alright? And have a good life. much fun together. Why are you trying to ruin our friendship, our beautiful friendship? I can see it in your eyes every day. But then I don't know what scares you in commitment. Because commitment sucks. 
To me, men are selfish. All they want to do is take advantage and use you when they don't really care about you. I've had terrible shares with them and I am tired of all of them. Gina, I am sorry you met this kind of man. But you and I have been together for a year now. I don't need to convince you that I'm nothing like them. I am a man who has his own mind. Listen, I promise to treat you differently. It will not be like anything that you've seen before, I promise. Please. But, but Zeno, you're a cheat. I mean, not like a cheat, but if you wanted something serious with me, why are you talking to other women? You wanted us to be friends with benefit. Yeah, but you don't need to throw that on my face. <laughs> wow. So, it, it got you? Well, I'm, I'm really happy I listened to Toby and I pulled this prank off. A prank? Mm-hmm. Uh-uh. Zeno, I see you video calling them. Flirting with them, laughing with them, and you're happy with them. Oh, come on, I made it up. It wasn't real, it was fake. I was just, um, you know, trying to make you jealous. It wasn't real. Gina, I love you. I promise I will never hurt you. Okay. I promise to make it up to you. Just give me this chance to prove to you that I'm nothing like this man. Please. I'll make up for everything they've done to you. I promise you. Gina. Oh. How long You're time. me? Yes, long yes. Time. Really long. How have you been? Good. Are you? Yeah, I've been good as well. Okay, um, baby, this is my ex and this is my darling husband. Oh, you're married. Oh, yes, I am. Nice, nice. nice to meet you. You know, I'm also getting married as well. Oh, you are? Yeah. Nice. My, my mom kind of got me this very beautiful girl from... <laughs> for my church, you know. She did. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Lovely. Did. Yeah, yeah, really nice. Oh, wow. I'm sorry, I didn't say you're pregnant. <laughs> yes, Whoa. we are pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's kind of like a coincidence because we are also expecting as well. Yeah, you know, my mom kind of insisted that um, the girl gets pregnant before the ceremony, you know. <laughs> she did. Yeah. Interesting. Did. <laughs> so, <laughs> it's like, Blessing, blessing. I see that. <laughs> yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, we are going to leave right now. Um, nice to see you. Oh, and yeah. regards to your mummy. 
Okay. Yeah, nice to see you. She'll hear. In fact, you know, I'm going to call her right now and tell her I met you. <laughs> She'll like that kind of news. <laughs> I was like, is you? She always likes for. Hey, mom. <laughs> 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 Wait, you, you actually dated this kind of guy? I know, he's a clown. <laughs> Mommy's rat. Honestly. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, who wants to clown?